Okay, you can stop with that cigar now, Gary. My sinuses will thank you. Brian, I read your article in the Daily Shopper. It was wonderful. Eh, don't oversell it, Lois. No, it was good. It almost felt like it was written by a real writer. I read your article too, Brian. Seems to me you should spend less time working for the paper and more time working on that novel you've been working on. <laughs> I like telling you. I am sorry you had to see that. Look, sir, I, I really need to confess something to you. That assignment I turned in... You know, Brian, before you came along I was so depressed I was planning to kill myself. But you have inspired me. If you can learn, maybe one day I can walk. No, what was it you wanted to say? Uh, nothing. You were supposed to get potato you up right now. Hi, I'm your roommate, Caleb. I like cutting myself. I bleed a lot. Can I have the top bunk? Uh... He already has a roommate, me. We're a couple of crazy college kooks. For example, we're about to make a hilarious answering machine message. Uh, you've reached Stewie and Brian. We're not here right now. Uh, and if this is Mom, uh, send money because we're college students and we need money for books and highlighters and ramen noodles and condoms for sexual relations with our class. And the airbag didn't deploy. Turns out they stole it. Sold it for spare parts. No way. It happens. They call them chop shops. Makes it harder to track stolen parts. Jeez, that is awful. Well, look, you guys got a lot of work to do. We should probably get out of your hair. Take it easy. Yeah, yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Don't Take forget to put your tools away. We blew it, didn't we? Boy, you can say that again. We were right there, ready to save Roger Williams Park, and we got sidetracked by idle conversation. We're a terrible... Oh, God. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, no, no, you're cute. You're cute. I, I, I don't want to pet you, though. Uh, uh, oh, all right. Uh, oh, 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 what are you gonna do? Oh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh, oh, no, okay, no, yeah, no, this, this spray is not for me. Brian, what are you doing here? Hey, you look just like Alf. Peter, I'm not Alf. Well, well, look who's here. All right, all right, look, I know an apology is due here, so... Lois, tell Quagmire you're sorry you had him arrested. Excuse me? He's the one who owes me an apology. He was watching me go to the bathroom. Well, clearly he thinks you're attractive, Lois. It's a positive thing. Thank you, Glenn, for complimenting our family. We have had it with his disrespect for women. We're petitioning the city to have him removed from the neighborhood. Yeah, I don't want to bring a new baby into the world with him. Hey, hey, Meg, they got a happy day spoof in here, but they call it crappy days. <laughs> uh, all right, you know what? If you're not going to laugh, then I'm not going to keep you company. This sucks. Now the only thing anybody's going to remember me for after I die is being that blind guy. Don't give up yet, Peter. I mean, many blind people lead rich, fulfilling lives. Oh, I don't know, Brian. I mean, I guess I can give it a shot. <laughs> oh, my God! I almost didn't do it. I almost didn't do it. I thought... Righteous white pins. Can't blame them for being self-righteous. The black balls in their neighborhood uninvited. The black balls done nothing wrong. If the black ball's innocent, it has nothing to fear. Huh. Wonder what the hell's down there. Judd Hirsch! Uh, hey. Uh, what, uh, what's going on? Nothing. All right. Makeup? Oh, no. I just, you know, since Peter went blind, it's actually been kind of nice not to have to worry about my appearance. I see. Is it really noticeable? Well, a little mascara wouldn't kill you. <laughs> I was kind of thinking I'd try an au natural thing. You think, uh, you think you have the skin for that? Oh, uh, let me light that for you, babe. Wow. Yeah, man. What the hell, CPR? Congratulations, Quagmire. You're the newest member of my Wall of Fame. What's wrong, Peter? Oh, it's nothing, Joe. It's, I don't know, it's, it's just that all you guys have something to be proud of, you know? Quagmire got a key to the city. Mort bowled a perfect game. You're always getting medals for catching crooks. Hell, even Cleveland used to be an accomplished auctioneer. I have 125. Do I hear 130? 130,000 for this authentic Comanche headdress. I got 130. I got 130. Do I... 
Everything all right here? Oh, fine, officer. Just uh, enjoying the sunset. No law against that, is there? What happened to your shirt? Oh, you know, <laughs> just a pizza party at the office. Oh, yeah? Where do you work? First Fidelity Insurance over on Way Bossett Street. Oh, my cousin Arnie works over there. Oh, Arnie's your cousin, is he? You know him? Oh, somewhat good middle management type. Just sort of blends in with the furniture, though. Never really wowed anyone at the office. Yeah, that's always been Arnie's problem. Well, take it easy. Yes, yes, you too. I mean, a uh, uh, sopping wet pair of breasts barely covered by a racing T-shirt. Peter, Mrs. Lockhart, we just wanted you to know so you could spare his feelings and let him down gently. Don't worry. I know exactly what to say to Chris. Thank you so much. You've been very understanding. Gosh, you know, I, I don't mean to impose, but do you have a picture of yourself that I could tape to the back of Lois's head? <sighs> yeah, I know, I'm late. Okay, let's just get started. Hey, yo, man, what's that thing in the middle? What, this? <laughs> You gotta be freaking kidding me. That's an ampersand. It's a symbol for the word and. My god, nobody can be this stupid. Not, not, not even Peter when he took that blow to the head and thought he was Larry from Three's Company. Jack, there's a hot tub party across the- Captain, my captain! Well, if it works for you, I guess so. Oh, Captain, my captain! Yeah, what the hell, be the best damn hooker you can be. Oh, Captain, my captain! In your case, I'd get the money up front. <laughs> Jack, twins! Swedish, my place, now. Ah! Oh, we're too late. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, I gotta call the police. No. No, what's that? Okay. I just wonder what happened to Miss Lockhart and that bear. The whereabouts of these suspects are currently unknown. You ready? What's that? I thought we'd try that lobster place we passed in the car. Yeah, can I just uh, finish watching this? You can watch TV anytime. I'm starving. Lana, this is going to be a real long trip if you don't knock off the crap. Love you.